To start creating this patch, add a Taurus SOP. After that add transform and copy. From the parameters of copy SOP, increase the number of copies to something like 18. I want to rotate these copies around Y axis. I have to move the center of the torus. By this, copies rotate around the center. Consider these beautiful shapes too. Move the center to have the copies with a little intersection. From the parameters of the transform SOP, rotate the torus to have it vertical. Adjust the copy SOP parameters to leave a little space between the torus copies. Then, add Null and Geometry. Add Camera. You can move the camera to somewhere like inside the rings. You can also change the translate parameter of the camera to adjust it inside rings. So this is my camera. In the intro clip I rotated this vertically by adding a transform SOP after the copy SOP. Add line material and assign it to the geometry. Then add render. Now add a new geometry from the null SOP. By doing this you have the line over the surface. So that it has line material but the inside is not visible. For this you also can change the near and far parameters to create a vision of depth. I keep the second geometry. Remember you can add surface operators to the second geometry of both. After the copy add null and transform before it. I want to use it to animate the tunnel. In the y-axis rotate parameter, type abs time dot seconds multiplied by 10. So we are in the loop. To make it more dynamic several noises can be added.
first, after the Taurus itself. Decrease the exponent and amplitude. Another noise after the transform at the end of SOP's path. Decrease amplitude and increase period. To add color, add ramp top and make it circular. Change extend to mirror. Now adjust the gradient however you want. Something like Bloom could be nice. And this is my visual for now. Thanks for watching.